Hi, welcome to LP Outdoors. Today we're going to build a customized wall-mounted PVTF retractable gazebo in our factory. Now follow me to see how we install it. We will pack goods in boxes and we will pack the small part in plastic bag. After unpacking, you can see a mortal box, a whole set of folding curtain, two guide rails, transmission tail, water guarder, it's been legs, and the lure blades for the protection cover. Now, here we go! After measuring the angle and distance, we can set the points of legs and wall code. When the precision is confirmed, we can nail this code on the wall. And these two holes need to match the holes on the wall. After measuring, we can set the point of it in, and we nail this part on the wall, and then we fix the it in on it. Now we fix the legs on the water gutter on the floor. Attach the parts to the water gutter with tools, taking care not to tighten the screw too tightly. Then insert the form legs into the track of the gutter, and then tighten the screw to fix it. Uh, we need to use this small part to mount a bolt hole on the water gutter so that we can connect the rail through this bolt hole. We move the front frame at the point we set and then we connect the it in on the legs. Now the main frame is basically complete, and then we install the guide ring. Please note that the waterproof strip is facing inward. You can see there is a hole on the bottom of the wheel, connected to the coal hole with bolts, and finally fits down with nuts. The wheel is set up, and now we install the transmission tail. After insertion of the tail, we need to use this cap to cover the suction. And this kind of cap is covered the mortal side. You can see there are three holes on the cap. Put one hole downward. And this one hole is for the electric wire. Put the two holes upward for the adjustment switch. Then fix the cap with screw and put the steel wire through the four hole screw. And open it at an angle to make it stable. We need to take the second bolt off. And after power on, we use the remote to control the first bolt over 50 cm out to save the space for the curtain. We install the PVDF curtain. There is a bolt hole in the first curtain rod on both sides. After installing the first rod, hand the pulley of the later curtain rod to check sufficiently. Then installing the penultimate curtain rod, we need to refix the second bolt on the end of the track. The last rod of the curtain needs to be connected to the end of the reel. And now, the whole curtain is basically complete. The next step, we need to use this adjustment rod to adjust the tightness of the curtain. The adjustment rod inserts two upward holes in the cap to trigger the switch. Hole A is close to the mortal. Now, we adjust the opening. Insert the rod into hole A, and then use the remote to make the curtain open forward. When the curtain moves to the middle, use the remote to pause. Turn the rod counterclockwise with several turns, more than 10 turns. And then, use the remote to make the curtain continue to open, until it stops and cannot move forward. Then we slowly turn the rod clockwise, and the curtain will extend forward to be tight. When the curtain is tight after opening, check whether the first curtain rod reached the gutter, and whether there is any current sound from the model. If you can hear the current sound, you need to turn it counterclockwise, until the current sound is no longer heard. Then we insert adjustment rod in hole B to adjust closed. Use the remote to recheck curtain to the middle position, and then pause. Turn the adjustment rod counterclockwise for a few more turns, and then use the remote to recheck the curtain. You will find that it cannot reach the end. Then we rotate the rod clockwise. The curtain will slowly recheck. Please note that there should be 3 to 5 cm between the last curtain rod and the penalty main curtain rod on the track. Otherwise, the motor will make current sound. This is the lure blade for the protection cover. Directly join the form and back of the lure to form a cover ball. Nail the seal on the reel, but do not hit it in the middle of the guide reel, and do not hit it in the middle. This curtain we have LED light strip system. Push this button and control its LED light strip. Now the gazebo is complete. Follow me to have an overview. Thanks for watching this video. If you like us, you can click like and subscribe to us. We will keep updating video on YouTube and TikTok. Thank you.